Hey, 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 messy gang, gang, gang. What's poppin'? What's going on? It's your girl, Drizzy. Welcome back to Drizzy Radio. Up next, we talk about celebrity gossip, celebrity news, trending topics. If you're new here, kindly don't leave without subscribing. If you're a returning subscriber, I want to say special shout out to you. Anywho, without further ado, let's continue the mess of the day. Because so you all know what's trending is Tanasha Dona and Zari, of course all across social media and them linking up and how they were being seen seemingly too too close that people are asking questions like is it the first time of the meeting you know it was just giving best friends vibe that have known each other for good years so what happened is you all know that the likes of mangi will always have something to say and trust you Mui, you all hear how Mangi been talking good about Tanasha lately? Well, give it a couple of weeks. Give it a couple of weeks. She will go back dragging Tanasha Donna because seemingly Tanasha Donna is becoming close with Zari and a little bit distanced with Amisa. And you all know that Mangi is team Amisa to the T. So Mangi decided to put her two cents into this situation. You all remember when... Zari was hanging out with Zuchu. People were saying things like Zuchu is with her maid. Zuchu, you know, she looked and kept. The hair is not giving. The dress is not giving. You know, I'm saying all of these things. And they were saying that Zari looked beautiful and Zari looked way younger than Zuchu in that video and also a couple of pictures that were making rounds on social media. Well, it so happened that this time round that um, uh, Zari is hanging out with Tanasha, it's seemingly like almost they want to turn, you know, this narrative that Tanasha looked good than Zari. I don't know. It's like they want to stir up some drama between the fan pages, okay? So what happened is, of course, Mangi took on her Instagram and, of course, said, Zari asipige picha na Tanasha sikuingine. Na msubiri awe anapiga picha na zuchu kiganganizi. La ila zari atufundishe na sisi ku edit picha jamani. Da. Okay, basically according to what she's trying to say to Manan Soili listeners, she's making it seem like as if she's perfect. You can see her without uh, editings over there, okay? So she was making it seem like zari should just take pictures with people like... Uh, uh, Zuchu because Zuchu is not up to Zari's standard according to Mangi Kimambi and like Tanasha taking picture with Zari that was a big mistake I think basically that's a big lie because they both look beautiful if you ask me and it's just that jealous people are trying to create this rift between these two beautiful women because they don't understand how is it that way like they don't they didn't expect it to be that way Okay, they also continued to say, Sasa nilikuwa na... Okay, by the way, hakuna friendship apo ni content to ya young, young, rich and famous na dai nai akaamua kuingiza wanawake zake kama yule jamaa wa South Africa. Okay, to Manansu Ili listeners, according to Mangi, she's saying that there's no friendship there, that this is all contact for the Netflix show and also... I think when they're talking about the, the guy that, you know, made all the baby mamas on that show, I think it was Andy Leia, the South African guy. I think uh, Mangi was trying to reference to that guy. So according to Mangi, she does not see any friendship there. The only thing that she see is content and that basically it. Okay. But I'm just wondering why were you so in a hurry to believe that Anasha and Hamisa have some sort of friendship and you're out here disputing that the same thing might have happened with Zari. I said something in the past and I'll still say it again. I have a feeling that Tanasha Donna and Ma Nandi are friends. Hamisa and Tanasha were just colleagues who worked together on a certain project. And of course, they had a good report with each other that when one visit another country, they hang out. But that doesn't mean that those friends that will stay up to hours and hours, you know, talking on phone. That is just how 
I see that went down and I feel like Mang is a little bit comfortable, uncomfortable with Tanasha being too, too, too close with Zari because remember they wanted Tanasha Donna on their team to give them some sort of validation. I'm just asking why don't you guys just leave Zari alone? She has never claimed that she's not 40 year old. So what is the new insult that you guys want to pour on her because this one is getting old honestly keep a class system is this your next bye bye